experience of an absolute lifetime. And so here are some of the things that I actually learned along the way. To be, to be successful and to be able to achieve your goal, you have to really align yourself with something, a vision that's much larger than yourself. Our team had a vision of winning an Olympic medal with the team pursuit. Each one of us have our own dreams. Dr. Wentz has a vision and a dream, so if you don't have one yet, tap into his because there isn't one much bigger than that. And represent that vision with pride. I, I can remember this, this moment exactly. I can remember looking down at that flag and being so proud. Know your why. You've heard this so many times this weekend, but know your why. Know what's important to you. This is one of the big things that's important to me now. What motivates you? What things do you want to be able to achieve? You know, what will keep you going when things get tough? You know, when, when I was in my bedroom in June last year, you know, this, the support and that belief, that dream that I had, that's what kept me going. And, you know, when you believe in something, you know, believe in your why and believe with your whole heart. It's, I had, I had this little, just this week where I was cleaning up my office and I had this little poster on, in front of my desk and it said, believe, believe with your whole heart. And it had a time, a 1500 meter time. I hadn't had a personal best in five years. And that time said 145.50. This year, I did a 145.43. So I did that time. And this is because I believed. Never be afraid of your dreams. Never, and never be afraid to dream big dreams. You know, when I was 11 years old, I, made, I met Gaetan Boucher, and that's when I first wanted to you know, become Olympian. And then that dream developed and it grew. And if, if I hadn't visualized this experience, if I hadn't visualized today, if I hadn't visualized getting that Olympic medal, it never would have happened. And so also, when you fall, you got to get up. Just like when I was in my first race, I got up. These guys, this is actually the Dutch team at the, at the, at the Olympics. They got up and they ended up winning a bronze medal. So success comes to those who persevere. Never give up. Never give up on your dreams, because if it's truly something that you're passionate about, you don't want to quit on it. You know, you want to follow through because you never want to think, what if? There's going to be hard times, but, you know, there's going to be good times too, but just don't lose faith. And again, I said this before, but the only way to fail is to give up. To achieve something great, you need the support of a team. This is my family. This is the team that I had. If you don't have one, build one. It's important to have fun. This is my retirement lap. <laughs> this is at the Olympics. Cindy Clausen actually put me up to this. This is the final lap that I ever actually did on speed skates, and it was in Torino. And so it's important to have fun in everything that you do. Don't think, take yourself too seriously, which is what I did for so many years. And so moving on to new goals and new dreams. I'm retired from speed skating now. I'm moving on. And my big purpose now is to be able to help people achieve what they believe to be unachievable, to motivate and inspire them to go after their goals and dreams. That's my mission statement. That's my purpose. That's what I want to be able to do.